Hi Aries and welcome to your daily video. I hope all of you are doing great today. Thank you for stopping in. So don't you love a Scorpio full moon? <laughs> it brings out the shadow in most people. Um, that is the shadow side, uh, the dark, the hidden. I even saw a tarot reader who I kind of enjoyed watching say, there's a tarot reader named Amy that is very, has a lot of views and she does dark magic on people and uh, she gets tarot readings on other people. First, I don't do any dark magic on anyone and secondly, I don't get any tarot readings on anyone. <laughs> so I don't know what that was about but I saw it for what it was and I was like, oh no, you know, oh well. <laughs> Um, that girl has a big channel too, so I don't know like what that's all about. Um, I certainly don't do any black magic on people, but I thought it was a little interesting. Anyway, so Spirit, please show us what's coming up here for Aries. What do they need to see or acknowledge? Five of coin. Needing something but not getting it. Um, needing to be included, you were given some, you were given some, but it's like you weren't given what you put in. Stability is needed in this situation. Um, the ship still needs to arrive. Okay, you are making a decision to go in a new direction. Um, perhaps the situation you're in is not satisfying. Um, okay, you've got new information, truth, clarity, a new idea, past energy, high priestess, following your intuition. Wow, tower. Okay. And what do we have here in the energies? Wow, you're coming up as a hero, being seen and recognized. The victory. So you're outshining someone. Okay. There's a page of cups. Innocent water energy. A message coming to you about emotions. You are not wanting to give up on a connection or a job or something like that. Okay, I got the Emperor coming out with the Two of Cups. You're in alignment with someone here, maybe a partnership. You have a bond that's quite strong. You've taken back your power. You have an idea here. Some information comes to you where you want to go in a new direction. This situation that you're in, either a relationship or a job, or a community it's like you put in a certain amount and you're expecting to get back at least what you put in and you're you didn't get that um so what is the tower something may have even been taken away from you with a five of coin and you're just kind of left out in the cold figuratively um, and so because this four of wands whatever goal you set for yourself now it's like you have to change course so what is the tower what is the tower the chariot you're determined to go forward in a situation You've put a lot of your energy into this with the Nine of Wands. It's something you're very passionate about. What is this truth or information coming to Aries here? Knight of Air. Comes in fast, quick, sudden. Rushes in, makes a point, rushes out again. Okay, so what is this uh, Page of Cups? 
Eight of Coins. Somebody is really looking at specifics, researching, looking very closely. But they're, they are a page of cups. They're um, a naive or new energy. This person is looking at details, looking into your life, working hard to build. Uh, why are you at a two of wands here? There's five of wands competitive energy there's something here about you know people not getting along challenging each other there's a seven of swords there's some dishonesty okay so bottom of the deck though is a nine of cups so you're gonna have some wish fulfillment some wish fulfillment some happiness coming your way Aries Oh yeah, you're going to be overcoming this manipulative person. They could have Gemini or, or Libra placements, but this is a manipulative, nasty person. Okay, so what is this Two of Cups? Who or what is this Two of Cups? A Nine of Coin, independent earth sign energy, having everything you want and need. You're taking back your power as the Emperor. Why are you Six of Wands? Being seen and recognized. A Three of Pentacles. Okay, you've invested in a team, a group. Something is... Um, money is flourishing. Things are flourishing. What is the chariot and the tower going forward fast? Determined to succeed. Okay, let's see. What is this chariot and tower? Temperance, patience, moderation, careful handling, and the world. A great success and a great achievement. Okay, let's just keep going a little bit more with this. So, you have everything you want and need. You have an ally, a friend, a supporter. You are taking back your power. There's a very conflicted energy here. You choose to go in a new direction because you maybe don't like the environment. You have a, the Chariot and the Ace of Water coming up. You will succeed. You will overcome this situation. Somebody was trying to manipulate a situation in maybe not in a good way. They're trying to create an illusion. All right. What's this outcome about with the Emperor? Four of Swords, take back your power. Don't communicate with this person. Go no contact. Two of Wands, go in a new direction. The world, you will be very successful. Three of Coin, you will be connecting to other people. Your money will flourish. Four of Wands, okay, stability comes in. Oh. The High Priest just reversed, Four of Cups reversed. There's a secret here about how someone feels. What is this manipulation with the Magician reversed? Somebody, a Queen of Water, could be any water sign. We have a Page of Water and a Queen of Water with the Nine of Swords reversed. This person could be... Um, extremely paranoid not just losing sleep at night extremely paranoid um okay here you are six of wands telling the world or again five of coin you didn't get back what you put into something
it's this page of cups. Now they are coming across as naive or innocent. What's the outcome? The secret is going to come out here with the moon reversed. What is this outcome? Four of swords, four of wands. Okay, there is something that was disappointing about the connection. Uh, Eight of Cups in the reverse. Possibly feeling like abandoning or leaving a situation but not doing so. The judgment, the karma. Someone's getting karma. Like their angel is blowing the horn to have an awakening in a situation. Why does Aries feel like they need to be at a two of wands? It, it does seem like there was a situation here that wasn't very good for you. The hangman reversed, the king of water reversed. You're no longer stuck in a situation. There could be someone who's highly emotional or unstable. Okay. The king of pentacles and the upright. There is someone that you can count on. Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or someone who is very committed to a situation. We do have the wheel turning on a situation that is not fair or out of balance. So there is justice coming in for you because the wheel is turning on this injustice. Okay, show us another one for Aries. So Aries goes no contact. You're letting your light shine really brightly. <laughs> Uh, okay, so what is the, what is this issue all about here? Why is Aries feeling five of coin? There was a tower. So let's see. Uh, we got the judgment. So there is something here about an awakening. Um, the day of judgment. The angels blowing a horn into a situation. The Hierophant in the Upright. Something will be corrected or done correctly. You could be dealing with an institution. Okay, I got the Chariot. You will be successful by going forward. Determined to go forward. Oh, and Justice in the Upright. Okay. So you are going to get justice. And what is your energy here, Aries, with the victory? Um, the Ten of Cups in the upright. What is this here? A Nine of Pentacles in the upright. Independent energy doing something on your own. Okay. What is this page of cups? Who or what is this page of cups? That's where you get the clarity and the truth or you get this new information. Um, this is the person who was coming in with the five of swords energy. They, they want to win no matter what the cost, but they're kind of bringing in negative energy. What is the, uh, moon reversed? What is the secret? Oh my God, again, it's the page of cups, but it's coming up as the reversal, reverse page of cups. So they come in as immature or, um, you know, this person, whoever this naive individual was, um, they're going to get their karmic justice. We have you coming in as the six of wands, the hero, the victory, overcoming difficulties, overcoming challenges. Okay, so let's see what we have here for Aries. The 
the treasure island. So you guys are coming in some, into something that's very bountiful, very successful. We have also feeling orphaned. There could be something where you feel left out in the cold, especially with that five of coin. There is something about a community, um, any kind of community here where you could be feeling this way. Getting in touch with water energy, emotions, feelings. Okay. If something is making you feel like you're being pushed to the edge, come to the edge, it says time to go. Like leave that situation. got no place like home okay let's see what else we get here for you Aries many doors are opening one door so you're being appreciated throat chakra and uh, one door closing, many doors are opening. Okay, we got the door to spirit and we also have all tied up. Like you feel like you're being prevented. Wow. Hostilities? There could be someone or an individual or people who are hostile that you're dealing with. Um, we have the fourth chakra, healing your heart, and a contract. We have the world expansion. Expansion. All right. Well, that's what I have for you, Aries. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video.